Two teens are facing charges tonight after being accused of spiking a drink with drugs and then giving that to another student. News Channel 8's Victoria Price joins us live from George Jenkins High School in Polk County. Hey, Keith, the sheriff hopes that this sends a message to kids that if you bring drugs to school, it's going to land you in trouble. Bad decisions today. You got two kids locked up. From Spanish class to second degree felonies, Polk County investigators say two 14 year old boys filled a water bottle with juice, spiked it, and gave it to a 15 year old girl who knowingly drank it in class. If you bring drugs to school and give them to other kids, that's going to get you a criminal charge every time. That juice tested positive for MDMA. Four students from George Jenkins High School were taken to the hospital. The sheriff's office says only three came back with drugs in their system. It was an opportunity for some children to overdose and die here today. A search of the boys' backpacks later found Xanax and a crystal-like substance. Both were released from the hospital and then booked into juvenile detention. They're still kids. They think like kids, but they committed a horrible felony act today. Neither of the boys have a criminal history or have been disciplined at school this year, which is why Sheriff Judd says stopping cases like this all starts at home. You need to be all up in your children's business. You need to know what's in that backpack. You need to know what's on that cell phone. And parents were notified of this incident through a school-wide message. Physically, we're told that all of the kids involved are going to be okay. Reporting live in Lakeland tonight, Victoria Price, 8 on your side.